Physics has a reputation as a difficult and complex field of study. It is undeniably a rich, intricate subject. Physics aims to answer our questions from the biggest questions about how the universe began and the rules we try to unravel, to the smallest subatomic particles, their composition, their behavior, and what they can do. Without physics, we would be without a huge range of knowledge and the study spans so many areas, from up and out in space to the fundamental rules that stretch across the universe. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we will be taking a look at three recent discoveries made in the field of physics. The Large Hadron Collider Discovered Mysterious X-Particles We have some fantastic equipment available to us that can help us explore and answer questions about the universe. One particularly impressive one is the Large Hadron Collider located at CERN, the European Organization for Nuclear Research. This is the world's largest particle accelerator, which for those of us who do not know all too much about physics, means this is a machine that lets charged particles move at incredibly high speeds. This is done by using electromagnetic fields. Being able to make particles move at such high speeds and high energies is very valuable in physics research, letting us learn more about how atoms and molecules work and, perhaps most importantly, they can help us to understand the laws of physics. This incredible particle accelerator, the Large Hadron Collider, has spotted some particularly interesting X-particles, which may have existed in the very, very early universe. Among trillions of particles within the accelerator, researchers spotted approximately 100 X-particles. They have their intriguing name X as we are yet to know of their structures. What makes these particles so interesting is that there is a significant possibility that the X-particles existed in the first few fractions of a second following the Big Bang. They have an incredibly short lifespan and do not hang around long, though their presence could give us some more info on the origins of the universe. The X-particles in question were seen in a wave of elementary particles known as a quark-gluon plasma. This was formed inside the Large Hadron Collider as a consequence of colliding lead ions against one another. Lead author of the study and member of CERN's CMS collaboration and an experimental particle physicist at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, Yenji Li, described this discovery as just the start of the story. He went on to elaborate that being able to prove that a signal is present is a huge leap in the right direction. The next step will take place over several years and involves the team investigating the internal structure of the X-particle using the quark-gluon plasma. This has the potential to tell us what sorts of materials the universe can and should produce. When researchers have investigated the origins of X-particles, they have found that they trace back to just after the Big Bang within less than the first second. This means that they were around when the universe was at an overwhelmingly high temperature, trillions of degrees, and was filled with quarks and gluons. These are elementary particles which, once they cooled, became the protons and neutrons we learn about today at school, which are significantly more stable. It appears before the temperatures dropped, giving us protons and neutrons instead of quarks and gluons, there was a short period where a few of the gluons and quarks collided, forming very few, very temporary X-particles. We still do not know exactly how the elementary particles formed the X-particle structure, but if we are able to somehow find an answer to this, then we will have a far better understanding of these particles that made up the early universe. A tiny particle's wobble could upend the known laws of physics. When we are trying to figure out something as big as how the universe works, it only takes a tiny inaccuracy to throw off everything that we thought we knew. Research from the spring of 2021 seems to have seen just that beginning to happen. A growing pile of evidence seems to be suggesting that a tiny subatomic particle is not behaving the way we would expect it to according to the known laws of physics. If it is indeed true that something is amiss here, then we have a huge gap in our knowledge of the universe. The odd finding could suggest 
that there are undiscovered forms of matter and energy that are key components to the way the cosmos has developed and evolved that our scientific community is yet to stumble across. By pursuing this new work, the discoveries we could make have the potential to be revolutionary, even more so than the discovery of the Higgs boson particle, the discovery of which earned a Nobel Prize in physics. Dr. Chris Polly, a physicist working at the Fermi National Accelerator Laboratory, also known as Fermilab, described this as our Mars rover landing moment. The weight of this soon-to-be achievement is incredible, with some physicists working towards this moment their entire careers. The particle in question is the muon, sort of like a heavy electron. Dr. Polly, along with an international team of 200 physicists spanning seven different countries, uncovered the odd behavior when it was fired through an intense magnetic field at Fermilab. By not following the anticipated behaviors, this challenges our current understanding of physics, which operates under the standard model. The particle has been consistent in its unusual behaviors, suggesting that there is a piece of the puzzle missing, and that something is contributing to this unsolved mystery. According to the research team, these measurements have only a 1 in 40,000 chance of being a coincidence, meaning this is statistically significant enough to be considered an official physics discovery. We are often able to find signals, but the data to support this initial discovery is what will make this such a fascinating opportunity. Over the next few years, an estimated 94% more data will be collected on the muon experiment to help us understand a little more exactly what was happening. This discovery has the potential to turn years' worth of assumptions about the universe, calculations and theories on their heads as we enter a new era of understanding. Hopefully more revolutionary work is to follow and transform what we thought we knew. Proxima D Space exploration is an incredibly exciting prospect. As we develop more technology and learn how best to make use of the science already at our fingertips, we get to explore further into space. Perhaps even better is getting to take a closer look at the places we thought we already knew. Scientists have recently discovered a new planet in the solar system that surrounds the star closest to Earth, besides the Sun. Proxima Centauri is the closest star to our solar system, just under 4.25 light-years away from Earth. The system is formed of two main stars, Alpha Centauri A and Alpha Centauri B, which together form a binary pair, meaning the two stars orbit one another and are bound together via gravity. The next part of this system is the third star, Proxima Centauri, also referred to as Alpha Centauri C. What is particularly interesting about Proxima Centauri is not just the close distance to our own solar system, but also that this star is relatively like our Sun. Scientists have a rather recent cause for celebration, as a new exoplanet, in other words a planet found outside of our solar system, has been found to be orbiting this star, with the research being published as recently as February 2022. This exoplanet is the third planet that has been found within this system. Back in 2016, Proxima b was discovered and the scientific community was thrilled. The exoplanet was a similar size to Earth and hosted conditions that could be suitable for life, with a temperature where we could possibly find liquid water and a rocky surface. Proxima d is a little different. As opposed to the Earth-sized planet it orbits alongside, the newly found Proxima d is one of the lightest exoplanets we have ever discovered, nowhere near comparable to the mass of Earth. The size of this planet is only the start of the differences. The possibly habitable conditions of Proxima b are not present in Proxima d. This newly found exoplanet is far too close to its star for life similar to humans to exist upon it. It orbits so closely to Proxima Centauri that the orbital period is only five Earth days long, compared to the 365 it takes us to orbit our star, the Sun. The discovery of Proxima d has led to several discoveries within this planetary system. Zhao Faria, lead author of the study and a researcher at the Instituto de Astrofisica y Ciencias do Espaço, said that this research shows us that, 
Our closest stellar neighbour seems to be packed with interesting new worlds, within reach of further study and future exploration. This goes to show that the great discoveries do not have to stretch across the galaxy thousands and millions of light years away, but that sometimes the most interesting revelations can be fairly close to home. But what do you make of these incredible discoveries? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comments section below and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.